Yo, what's up, everybody? It's your boy, Big Daddy Mo. Toast, toast, toast. <laughs> 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 I didn't check the mic. I, I think we're good. Think hey, we're whatever. Good. This, what's up, everybody? This is your boy Big Daddy Mo, chilling with L Scribbler, of course. Yeah, you 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 watch Space Jam. I saw Space Jam last night. Yeah, Lola Bunny was the start of many 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 a craze, many hey, a cause, fans. Because as a kid, I didn't really like you know it was, it was just cartoon. Like, hey, you know, Bugs Bunny has a girlfriend. Nice. Then as I grew older, I was like, hey, yo, wait a minute. Now. Yeah, they they really. I, I wouldn't mind coughing up some hair Basically balls just, after that. Jessica Rabbit kind of situation. The animated character went. They, they really animated her. Yeah, Lola, Lola Bunny was fine. Hey, I, I, I mean, Jam? I'd still smash this Lola Bunny too. But well, uh, so, well, uh, I, I didn't watch the, the new Space Jam, and I don't think I ever will because it's Looney Tunes is not 3D. Okay, okay, it's actually, not 3D. Stop though. I, I'm actually I don't actually don't have a problem with it now that I watched it. What's up, Bolt? Okay, so uh, what was it? Well, okay, because the animation there's like. We have the you have the original animation, and then we also have the 3D. The 3D animation only comes in when they're getting ready to do the basketball game, because uh, this basketball game is set inside. Uh, it's it's made from LeBron's son's um, video game, because uh, basically the whole movie is LeBron is kind of like tough on his kids because he wants them to be as great as he is. But his son, his youngest son, um, is all into video games, and he actually creates a video game. So while he's trying to go to this um, the E3 uh, whatever summer thing, LeBron wants him to go to like basketball camp and all that. So when they get sucked into the video game, um, into the what's it, what's it, the server verse, which is you know the internet and all that. Uh, Don Cheeto's the bad guy, and he he finally wants recognition for everything that he's doing. He's basically, I swear, when I saw this, it reminded me of Eagle Eye. So this is this is Wreck It Ralph. I guess. Yeah, Wreck It Ralph. Yeah, it was or Wreck It Ralph or Ready Player One. Yeah, Ready Player because One. The any, entire any, any video game where you're or any, any so Ready Player One, Log Horizon, Sword Art Online. Because the entire movie we're seeing stuff from Warner Brothers. So like when they're uh, okay, let me get let me let me start with the 3D animation. So now when we get to the basketball game, he's like okay, um, Don Chu's like okay, we're about to give him an upgrade, and now everybody's 3D animated because this is in um, LeBron's kids video game. But uh, yeah, like it feels like Ready Player One because when they're rounding up the the Looney Tunes again, all of a sudden, like, okay, where's a uh, Road Runner and a uh, Wally Coyote? They're in Mad Max Fury Road. <laughs> so I'm not gonna. I thought I was gonna hate that, but seeing, but putting them in all these movies, like putting Granny and Speedy Gonzalez in the Matrix and all that, that was actually entertaining stuff. But uh, the whole movie, it wasn't funny, bro. It, it, well, it's not. Space Jam was basically going to the Looney Tunes world, but. They're going into a video game Don, world now. Don it's Cheadle, uh, you know, he he came went to Looney Tune Land. Was like, hey yo, y'all are better better than this. You know, so we can put you in big, you know, movies and all that. Only person that stayed in Looney Tune Land was Bugs Bunny. So that's why when LeBron is like, yo, I need a, a team, and he's he's sitting there trying to get like Superman, like Batman, and all that. And then meanwhile, Bugs Bunny's like, oh yeah, I got somebody better, Porky Pig. So he's getting his Looney Tunes back together. But yeah, like the basketball game itself was not funny, bro. It was kind of like there was like, no stretching the arm. There was no, no there was no see, epic moments. The, the whole game. Was I didn't know like, Dan Aykroyd was in this picture. Right. The whole game. The whole basketball game was just like a because the video game wasn't like the fundamental basketball. I mean, even though the first movie didn't have fundamental kind of didn't have fundamental basketball, it was just them beating each other up. But we have like you know style points. Yeah. So you sit there do a like a alley oop passes like five people epic instead of dump. instead of getting like three points, you get like a thousand points. So I was just like, okay, I guess. So when it comes time for the Looney Tunes to do their thing, honestly, right when the movie ended, I forgot all the cool stuff they did, and I just jumped straight to the, the space, the original Space Jam video um, basketball game. It was it wasn't funny, and I know I already know a lot of people are going to hate it just because of LeBron. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's the main hate. But I don't care about LeBron, even though his acting was like whatever. I don't find him as a, a good actor. It was just it wasn't funny. Well, the story wasn't there either. I, I didn't have a problem with the story with, you know, his, his, the family dynamic, him and his son. I'm like, okay, I get it. But I, this is Looney Tunes, bro. I, I, like, st I still prefer the original where they, the, the kids, the kids basically, uh, they hear that their father, like, where's our father? It's just like, oh, he's helping us out. It's just like, oh, okay. Yeah. And then I the mother's that. all asking to just like, shh, we can't say, we can't say. Yeah. I love stuff like that. I love the fact that in the original day, uh, what is it? What is it? The, uh basketball players get their talent taken away so now we're also dealing with them and with them not having their talent and, anymore. and like the, the girl little girls watching like the roadrunner and it's like where'd they go yeah I, they, were, they were both 
off the screen. They, they focused on Michael Jordan and the Looney Tunes, whereas this one, it just focuses on LeBron. And I, I mean, Bugs Bunny is there, but I'm just like, I need all the Looney Tunes, bro. It just, it, it just, it wasn't it. It yeah. wasn't it for me. Daffy Duck wasn't being thrown through the ringer. Daffy Duck was still funny, bro. Okay, okay. <laughs> I still love Daffy Duck. Daffy Duck but... was getting destroyed when he was getting chewed by the dog. What's oh, the dog's name? Oh, I forgot. But yeah. Oh my gosh, that was great. See, that's but that's what I'm saying. I feel like they focus more on Good their. Uh, boy. They, I feel like they focus more on their property. I mean, they had Lola Bunny um, training to become a uh, Amazon, so she's with a Wonder Woman. And yeah, they, they were focusing more on like, hey, guess what? We have Mad Max. Oh yeah, guess what? We have Harry Potter and all that. There, I see more. They, so they basically, more the way than, Ready Player One yep, took advantage they of all more that. more on that than Looney Tunes. And I had no problem if they used it, you know, good. You know what I'm saying? I, if it serves a purpose to the story, it fine. Didn't. It really did. Well, that's the thing. Wasn't it just the Looney Tunes versus? In the first one? No, the se the second the remake. The goon, uh, the, this one is they going against the goon squad, and I didn't care for not one of those. Okay, the monsters. Because all the they best. did was just um, you know, the kid scanned the basketball player so he could put him in their video game, and then this time he took them and then kind of like made them to like you know spider or snake, and I'm just like, I don't care for him. Okay, yeah, you got Clay Clay Thompson and um, I think it was Anthony Davis basketball players. I'm like, so. Yeah, well, so well, I like the monsters. The yeah, monsters well, the monsters stole their powers. Is this show man from the real players? <laughs> yeah. And it's just like, and the fact that they didn't want to be bad, they just wanted to. They get a cameo, which was which was great. But yeah, I was just upset with it. I'm like, bro, like, like I said, the second I finished it, I went straight to the actual basketball game from um, the original Space Jam. Enjoyed the entire thing. Yeah. I was laughing. The, it's the plays were awesome. Like, come on, from start to finish. Even when you know they're in the locker room gearing up, you, you got the line of cars outside just ready. Ready. I didn't get that here. Just like okay, everybody that looks at the phone is gonna get zapped here. You're here. You're here. It was like it felt like they was making it too serious, and I didn't care for it. Yeah, it has to be playful. So and and play on jokes like the what is it the. Uh, what is you, what are you chicken? I happen yeah, to yeah. that I resemble that remark. <laughs> but, it struck by lightning, turns into fried fried chicken. Oh my god, that was great. <laughs> <laughs> what you say? What you, original uh, original recipe or extra mm -hmm. crispy? <laughs> <laughs> See, yeah, I did not. More quotable. I can, I can remember that just because it was such a great movie. No, they did bring back Michael Jordan. Okay. Michael B. Jordan. <laughs> they were like, we got Michael Jordan. And all of a sudden, I start looking at his head. I'm like, hey, that's Michael B. Jordan. He was like, yeah, I'm just, I went to get some popcorn, then his cat brought me in. <laughs> I was just like, okay, I'll, I'll, I'll mess with that. But um, yeah, they could have they kept this one. They could have kept it. Heck, why not just make Michael B. Jordan the main character? Then I'd actually enjoy yeah, it. They got the wrong Michael Jordan or yeah. something. Yeah. <laughs> I, I would like, like it that. was the accidental wrong Michael Jordan, and they just have to figure out a way to make it already, work. I already know there's going to be so many memes because I swear LeBron was crying the entire time, especially when somebody do like well, a super. We already have a ton of memes with LeBron crying. We got some more. We, somebody do a super duper dunk. What? I was like, oh god, here comes the memes. But uh, I'm glad I didn't go see it in theaters. I'd have been mad. I would have been mad. Waste of money. Oh yeah, I'm gonna go see um, Escape Room tournament, tournament of champions. I swear the escape room movies feel like Saw. Yeah, and then then because it's just like, so we the only one escape room movie is out, so they're just adding in. It's basically like Triple X, the sequel, the the movie where they just added in more Triple X just to make it seem more epic. Something like that. Yeah. Try to give them all a backstory, just yeah, like so now they have the girl who can't feel pain. Yeah. It still looks good. The first, have you seen the first one? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I surprisingly enjoyed the first one. Yeah. yeah well, it, it's like a. It basically reminded me of a hundred, four hundred fifty degrees, where they're stuck in the sauna trying to escape. Have you seen that? Nope. It's supposed to be a horror movie. It's very cheesy, very dumb. Four hundred and fifty degrees. Something, something dumb. It's something about it's where you get to the boiling point, and they need to escape the sauna before they all die. Wow. Yeah, and it, it kind of I was like the escape, uh, the escape room, and I was like, crap, it's going to basically crazy. be that. I never. Uh, uh. Is it good or at least enjoyable? Uh, uh, I can't remember it. Mm. <laughs> it look, but Escape Room looks good. I can't wait to check it out. But uh, yeah, yeah Space Jam: New Legacy, especially if you're if you grew up with the original Space Jam, it's pointless. This one is trash. I did not enjoy. It. Again, it's not because of LeBron. It's just because it wasn't funny. It was whatever. They focus more on their on their properties of like Harry Potter and DC and all that. Of like, course, why wouldn't they? Yeah. Like I said, it didn't serve a purpose. I mean, I wouldn't mind having Superman play some basketball. <laughs> like I would like to see how that goes, but uh, yeah, it was it was whatever. 
So it, had, they, it had its moments where I was laughing. So did they actually have actors, or was it primarily animated? So when they were on... Um, oh, they had actors, and it was animated. Okay, so, the, so they had Gal Gadot be Wonder Woman? Oh, no, 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 no. Um, animated. Okay, yeah. that was animated. Yeah, um, I mean, cause like when they did Mad Max, they didn't have no Tom Hardy. It was basically... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> okay, that was funny. You didn't see no Charlie Stern or um, Tom Hardy. Just saw like all the, uh, you know, the, the characters that they're getting ready to go against, like the. Sh- yeah, yeah. Wiley Coyote doing that was great. I was like, come on. I can't go lie. Stuff like that was awesome. Yeah. I mean. So they have cool scenes, funny scenes, but the movie itself it, isn't it memorable fell flat. enough. To, yeah. It fell flat. Great. Yeah. So that's yeah. That's that's, that's my mm-hmm. take on Space Jam. And I'm gonna do a review on it. Uh, yeah, check, I, check it. Check yeah. it out. Check yeah. it out. Check it out. Yeah, but uh, yeah. Thanks for watching. Um, check out other videos. Uh, you know, check out my YouTube page, Big Daddy Mo, El Scribbler. But yeah, mm-hmm. and um, thanks for watching. And as always, I will see y'all next time. Peace. Toodles.